interested sniper 42 here at sniper rod and custom shop um, <coughs> as you can see with a 26T I'm about 90% done now I'd say about 90% yeah 90% done oh quickly uh, styrene junkie 73 I uh, hope you're enjoying your uh, your day down at the, at the old coast hope you enjoy it hope you pick up some models on the way <laughs> Anyway, um, yeah, as I say, I'm about 90% done now. Um, I've basically got the 32 Ford grill on. Got a few bits to do. Uh, I've actually now got the exhaust actually in the mounted. Just need to make a bracket for that. Um, that's all I've got done. Oh, yeah, I've. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. Uh, I've got the discs in. Let's see if I can get this because the body's still not on properly. I've got down in here, as you can see, I've got the actual um, uh, flexible hoses down going into the hard lines all the way from the front to the rear. As you can see, there's so all, all the way across there. And also in the back. I've got the uh, got them all in there. There's the uh, flexible lines in there as well. Shocks I made myself. Obviously, most of it I made myself, as you know. Uh, I've got the transmission cross brace in there now. Uh, what else have I got done? Uh, got the the brake booster in there. Well, not the booster, the actual uh, reservoir, should I say? I've wired the plugs in that. Uh, the wires for the thingies are there. They're just not plugged in because obviously, <coughs> excuse me, the body's got to be uh, taken off again and put back on. I've got a few bits to do underneath, so it'll be taken off. And also, when I dull coat it, sorry, when I dull coat it, I've got to also uh, um, take the body back on. Didn't really think about that with the grill, but it doesn't really matter. I can hand paint that one instead. Um, I've got the steering column in now. And the steering wheel, which I painted red. My own shifter and shift knob there. So it's pretty much, pretty much, nearly done now. And I think that my little mishap with the uh, with the matte dull coat from Humbro, which I will not be using again, actually has turned out quite well actually. Because it means that I've, I've weathered it up a bit more, and the white just sort of seems to add to it. I quite like it actually. Now I've got used to it. So, yeah, had a bit of a problem when I was installing the discs. I managed to snap my axle, that, my homemade axle that I made, but uh, I fixed it. So I'm not going to complain. I've mounted obviously the. The radiator, I've got the hoses to put on yet, and uh, as you can see, it's mounted from the chassis there into the sides of the grill. Also, drilled out the grill all the way around as well. Got the tie rods in on the sides there now, so that's coming on. As you can see, so I'm quite pleased, excuse me, pretty pleased with that. Um, haven't got because I've been working on that. Haven't really got a lot further with the uh, 37 yet, but it has has come out of paint. I was actually probably maybe the next hour. So it's been raining and it's getting a little dark here, so the temperatures drop. So I'm not quite sure whether I'm going to paint this um, when I'm going to clear coat this tonight. I don't know. I don't know. It's the weather, but the, yeah. but this is what I've done with the paint on that. You probably can't tell it looks probably probably to you guys looks blue, but it's actually uh quite a a large metallic purple flake. You might just be able to see hints of it possibly. And I've done it. Two toned it. So I think actually I quite like that combination, it suits that pretty well actually. So, 
I haven't really got a lot much further with that. Um, so look, yeah. As I say, yeah, I've, that's pretty much as far as I've got with the chassis. I've got a few bits. Ah, there they are. Got a few bits. Started painting them up, the rear axle, and I've actually weathered that. Put a wash on it. So I've start started doing bits of it. As I say, I've start done the mo done started the motor as well. So yeah, there we go. So I've started doing that. Uh, what else have we done? Obviously done the doors, the boot. Or the trunk, whatever you wish to call it. Also done, started the dash. Of course, a bit of a glare of that, blimey. Uh, yeah, done a bit the dash and the gold as well. Might have to modify it for where the... Because uh, the hinge is obviously there, so... I might have to modify it when I put that in. Um, but to, Yeah, that's about it. Other than I've got a... Uh, oh, I can't remember what it is. Oh, what, what, hang on one second, let me see if I can dig it out. It, it needs clear coating, and, and, and I've decided to do a, take it out of my start kits. Uh, excuse me one minute, guys. Oh, there we go. It needs a bit of... Uh, let's move this. Get that body out of the way, and these bits. Let's get these bits out of the way. Sorry if I'm jabbering you just seeing uh, 26. <laughs> but... It, it's got a few bits to be put on, rear door and sun visor and and that, but it needs a, it's been in the box for ages, in the, uh, well, in my part built tub, and uh, it needs clear coating. It's, uh, the paint's pretty, you know, as you can see, a bit dusty, even though it's been in the box, but this is the project I've had. This has probably been actually in the box for about three years. Painted, got this far, but never actually went any further with it. This is as pretty much as far as I've got with it. Yeah, I've got the. I can never ever find over here in the UK Pegasus wheels or anything like that. I always end up with these nasty wires, fake old wires that you get. Is it going to. No, it's not going to, is it? No, it doesn't focus. Yeah, anyway, I can't get... It's never find them for love nor money over here. Uh, I think I had to make the firewall because I couldn't find the original one. Uh, so... Yeah. Still got some work to do on it. I'm going to... I'm, I'm going to... I've seen I've got it, one of the headers fell off. It's in the box. <laughs> but I'm going to... I'm going to now... Uh, probably add to it now. I'm going to add the little bits for the... Uh, Air cleaners that come out to screw it on. Uh, I might even wire it. Do a bit of wiring on it, maybe. I don't know what else, but yeah, it's been in the box. It needs clear coating. It has. It's been in the box for about three years, I say. And uh, that's pretty much as far as I've got with it. As you can see, I haven't put any of the chrome bits on the sides because of the clearing. So a pretty simple interior. I might add a bit. A bit, <laughs> a bit dusty in there. Might add maybe some. Something to some piping or something in there, maybe, possibly. But yeah, that's it. And that, to be honest, that's pretty much. I was going to clear coat that. That's actually what I was going to clear coat tonight. But I might leave that for during the week. I'm not really sure, to be honest, because I don't know what the weather's going to be like. And after my last experience with a. Uh, clear coats. I really don't fancy doing it again. Um, but, I mean, not, not being funny, let's put this down a sec. Yeah, not being funny, that that clear coat, matte clear coat from Humber Roll was rank. It really was rank. I really, when I opened the pot, I should have noticed. Yeah, I'll show you guys that. I don't know if you can see it. Try and tip it up without spilling it everywhere. Let's pick this thing up. Boop. Let's get this thing up a bit. Let's see if you can see in it. Look. There. It's actually 
grey white. And and or if you can see the yellowy colour around the edge here, that's actually how it's dried on everything I've put it on so far. So coming off that was an arse. It really was an arse. So clear coat in it. Um, <coughs> I'm not to uh, think, but I've checked the other kit. I've got clear coats from Ravel, gloss clear coats, and I've checked them, and they're completely, <laughs> and they are completely clear. <laughs> anyway, yeah, chuckling to myself, still annoyed, but never mind. Yeah, so I may clear coat it tonight. Probably not. I might do it tomorrow now because it's getting on here. Um, uh, it's Sunday, by the way. Sunday evening in the UK. And uh, I might upload this Monday, probably maybe Tuesday at the latest, depends on whether I go in and get nagged at to do something. But anyway, um, yeah, 